hit the record button just to see if uh, there's a way to post this or whatever for the group. But I just uh, finished off my fizz this morning. Had a little bit of detox tea. Go Arbon. Now we're ready to get pumped. So um, we're going to start today just by a nice, easy um, stretch forward. So grab your hips. Take the left foot up as high as you can. Reach it all the way forward and just stretch into that left leg. Nice, deep leg stretch. If you're too tired already, you can rest that knee if you want, but just get a nice forward bending stretch. You can reach the arms up, breathe in deep, and then exhale, fold over that leg. And then you're gonna step back with that leg and bring the other leg up forward. And do the same thing, stretch forward. Right now, just warming up the hips. Getting nice in there. Reach your arms up again, breathe in deep. And exhale, pull forward, nice. Bring that back and come to a downward dog, pressing the body up. And just hold for about three to five breaths, walking out your dog, doing anything that feels natural to you. Just kind of warm up the lower body here. We're we'll beginning into some fun, so I want to make sure we stretch it out real good. Beautiful, now continue to walk your hands all the way back to your feet. Breathe in, flat back. Exhale, come back down and then walk your hands back all the way up. We're gonna do three of those. So now come all the way up. If you want the next level, do a push up. Push back up and then walk your hands back up to downward dog. All the way up, roll the body, reach your arms up in the air, breathe in and let it out with a giggle. <laughs> and walk back out. It's never too early to giggle. Push up, push back. And from all the way back. Let's do it again. Breathing in. Breathing up and let it out with a giggle. <laughs> <laughs> a little laughter yoga for your morning. Wake up the body. One more. This time we're going to let it out with a big laugh. Reach arms up. Breathe in. And let it out with a laugh. <laughs> And just hang, bringing the elbows to the hands, hands to the elbows. Swing in a little bit if you want. Beautiful, and then peel the body all the way up, shoulders to the ears, and drape them back, nice. We're just gonna warm up the joints a little bit with some joint circles. And just remember the joints each have their own um, sound. So we're gonna grab the knees and the, the knees go, ooh. Ooh. Just do some circles in one way and then go the other way. Ooh. And say, ooh. Then we're gonna get a nice horse riding stance, feet planted, and we're gonna go, oh. Yeah, get into those hips. Oh. Oh. Nice, now the next one's a heart opener. And do the, uh, shake your ribs and go, Ah. Oh, ah, it's a heart opener. Ah. And then bring the shoulder Go E. And go the other way. And you can grab the right hand to the left ear and go ah. Grab that left hand to the right ear and go ah. And then just shake it off. Oh. Yeah, just shake it. No, no. Oh. no more. One more shake. All that stress and tension right out of the body. Oh. Nice. Take a big breath in and let it out with a sigh. Beautiful. Now we're just going to start with some jumping jacks. So start coming out and in at your own pace. Just getting a little blood pumping now, a little heart respiration. Breathe it in through the nose, out through the mouth. Now bring the knees up high. Now double time. Ten more. Eight. Six. Five. Four. Three. 
two, jump up. <sighs> nice, take a big breath in and let it out with a sigh. One more of those, big breath in and let it out with a sigh. Beautiful, we're gonna reach up, bend all the way to the right side. Reach or you can mirror me, whatever feels good to you. Just take a nice stretch to the side. Breathe in, reach up. Ah, Bend down the other side. Nice long stretch. Beautiful. Coming back up. Breathe in. And come all the way down, bending forward, breathing out. Exhale it completely. All right. Now we're going to plant our hands. And we're going to lift one foot up. And then put it back down. Lift the other foot up. And put it back down. And one foot up. And put it back down. And another foot up. And put it back down. This time we're going to make a D with the right leg. So it goes up and then around. And we'll do that three times. So up and around. Two more up and around. One more up and around. And that switches to the left foot. Up and around. Fill this in your glutes. Up and around. We said we're going to have a kick butt good time. Up and around. One more for good luck. Up. And around, nice. Swap the hands back up to the feet. Bend the knees, breathe it in deep. And bring the hands to heart center. Ah, nice. Now we're starting to get that blood pumping, the heart moving. We're gonna get a little more haas in our life. So we're bringing the arms out like goal posts. And we're gonna do washing machine haas. So you're gonna turn one direction. Ha, 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 ha. And it'll slow the speed up. Ha. All right, good job. Good job. Take a second if you want to grab some water. Good warm-ups, y'all. Nice work. We're going to start getting into the lower body here. So we'll start with feet parallel, about hips width apart. You guys good? All right. Perfect. So we bring that right foot back and come into a lunge. And then you're going to bring that right foot forward, trying to balance on that left knee. Driving the right knee into the sky. Come back down. Bump it up. Boom. That's one. Boom. That's two. Focus on balance. And remember, if you fall, that's okay. We're going to fall in life. The fall is what defines you. It's how you deal with the fall. So if your leg gets tired and you start to fall, good. You're challenging yourself. And you're giving a safe place to deal with judgments. Four more. Almost there. Three. Drive that knee. Nice work, too. Yep, you can smile. And one. Good. Switch feet. Go back. Ten. Beautiful. Keep it up. And have fun with it. Hey, we're just here to move the body in ways that's conducive to health. So that way we get some physical aspect to our inner cleanse work, which is all we really want. Three more. Here's two. Last one. Boom. Nice, good job. Now we're gonna do a curtsy lunge. We're gonna take this right foot back behind the left, kick it out to the right. I like the toes pointed, you know, for the ballasts. The ballasts. So let's bring that right foot to the back. Nice deep curtsy squat. Boom, 10 of those. Beautiful. You'll feel this in a whole other area of your gluteotomous. <laughs> your gluteus minimus maximus and medius. All in one. <laughs> Look at that baby's getting to work out. <laughs> we didn't even do upper body yet, Heidi. You're ahead of us. <laughs> three more. There's three. Beautiful. Are you pointing those toes nice and pretty? Boom. Last one. Hey, Kelsey, welcome. Boom. All right. Now we're going to switch to the left leg. Curtsy lunge on the other side. Pick it up, hold them toes. Beautiful. Two. 
Jump into a plank. Two on the elbows. One. Oh, like that. Go. Drop right into a plank and hold. Breathe in deep through the nose, and through the mouth. Stay strong. Stay solid. Thirty seconds. Uh, yeah, the heart's here. Here you go. Strength. And the power. Of how strong you actually are. <laughs> yeah. The mind always wants to quit before the body, so just stay strong and tell yourself some positive stuff. I mean, you're already here, aren't you? And if you want level two, you can walk up with the hands and walk back down. We're going to do three more of those. Walk up with the hands and walk back down. Two more, walk up with the hands. If you're in plank, hold that plank. Last one, walk up with the hands. Hold plank for five, four. Three, two, and rest. Beautiful. Take a sip of water or take a rest. We're going to take a 20 second rest here. Breathing in deep and exhaling sweetly. Gentle. In the rest, see if you can drop your heart rate quickly. That's one of the number one signs mm -hmm. of health. Is if you're all out of breath and your heart's beating fast, can you then internalize that channel of energy? This is the heart. Yeah. Oh, oh, oh. Right. Right. Here you go. Rapid. Find that inner core. Okay. What do you want to do for that? Yeah, back up to our. That's a good idea. Got to get that straight. <laughs> All right. This time we're going to come down to a nice sumo squat. So legs planted, toes at 45 degrees out. Coming to that squat, we're going to tuck our elbows and cross our punches. So we're actually bringing our elbow right to our own chin. If you can see, the elbow to my chin. Elbow to my chin, but stay in that squat. Get a nice workout for the glutes, the hamstrings, the quads, the legs, the feet, everything by twisting. You're getting that core engaged. So suck that core in. We're just holding this nice position here for 10 more. Nine. And you can smile, that's okay. Eight. And if you got a baby, lift the baby. That's just more upper body work. <laughs> Five, four, beautiful, keep it up, three, two, one, you're ready, plant the hands down, pop the feet back or walk, and then you're going to step right, left, clap, clap, back down, left, right, left, right, clap, clap, and we'll slowly speed up, right, left, Right, left, left, right, left, right. Here we go. Right, left, up, up, clap, clap, back, down, left, right, left, right, clap, back, down, right, left, right, left, clap, clap, back, down, right, left, left, right, clap, clap, two more, left, right, left, left, clap, clap, oh yeah, left, right, left, right, clap, clap, and yay! Very good, very good, yay! We can all do that together, can't we? Clap with your full palms together and say, very good, very good, yay! All right, in fact, let's do another exercise. This one's called wood chopper. So we're gonna take our ax, we're gonna be burly Humboldt men out here, or women, they're here too, and we're gonna chop our laughter tree, ha, ha! 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 Speed it up! Ha! 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 Very good. Very good. Yay! Yay! So those we can always do together. It's just bringing out that childhood joy, you know? Like, like you're getting your first bicycle at Christmas or a new puppy. Yay! We just want to get that exuberance to the body. Keep it young. Keep it fluid. Keep that joy in the center of our hearts and in our bellies. Nice core work. Oh, that's right. 
Did I hear core work? Okay, you win. So we're gonna start with this first one. You're gonna come down low, and if this is your place, that's it, you'll stand back up. Level two, you're gonna come down low and you're gonna roll, and you're gonna keep the stomach engaged, and then come back up to the feet. Stomach engaged the whole time. So that's level two. Level three is you put a little hop in there. Hop back, hop up. Level three, all right? So we're gonna put the timer on here for 30 seconds. We're gonna do 30 second rolls here on your marks. Uh, get set, go. Hop, there it is, yay. Woo! -hoo! Feel free to let out any exclamations of joy or proclamations of happiness. That's for you. Yippee! Keep going, 10 more seconds. Go! Five, four, three. Can you get one more in? Two. Yay! Nice. Now we're going to bring our knees up to the opposite elbows. Opposite elbows. <clears throat> Try to bring the knee to the elbow more than the elbow to the knee. But keep that core sucked in. Keep that body engaged. Yeah. And feel free to turn the corners of the lips up. <laughs> Get a nice smile in there. It just helps make your core feel so much happier when you're doing some core work. Beautiful. 15 more seconds here. 10. Nine, eight, keep it up, seven. You only get as much as you put into it. Five, four, three, two. Now we're gonna come down, we're gonna bring the hands. We're gonna drop a foot back and the opposite arm in the sky. Then that arm's gonna come down, that foot's gonna come back, we're gonna stand back up. Then we're gonna come down, bring that right foot back, left hand to the sky. We're gonna come back, stand tall. So come down. Left foot, right hand, come up, come down, right hand, left hand, right foot. Okay? So we're gonna do that two more times so we got it, and then we're just gonna stay on the ground. So there's one. Okay, one more round. Beautiful. Believe in you guys, you're doing great. All right, now we're gonna stay down and just alternate. So left foot, right hand. Bring it back, right foot, left hand. Boom. Start getting in the flow. One move, one breath. One move, one breath. This is like easier than the beast walks. Because we don't actually have to travel. We're just teeter-tottering back and forth. You got 15 more seconds. Push all you got. You got this. 10, 9, 8, 7. Here we go. Six. Five, four, I believe in you. Three, two, and one. Beautiful. All right. How are we doing on time? Doing just great. All right, so we're gonna come back. Oh yeah. Woo! Just take a second to get into an egg position and grab your knees, breathe in deep, and let that lower spine release. Maybe rocking back and forth a little bit. Maybe taking a leg to the sky, getting a little stretch in the hamstring. If you did that, feel free to do the other one for a minute. Beautiful. And just rock a little bit. Whatever you need to do, release that lower spine. And then take your hands behind your ears. Everybody's favorite PE position on your back bicycle. So right leg kicks out, right elbow comes across, switch to the left elbow. Beautiful. Really reach out for the extension. Try to have your feet only stay in less than a foot off the ground. That's 30 centimeters for all my international folk. <laughs> Go back and forth in a nice pace. I like to breathe in on one and out on the other. The more we control our breathing, the more we're focused on our breathing, the less that we're in our uh, heads and the more we're in our bodies. That way we're feeling and making sure everything feels good and we can purposefully engage those muscles that we're trying to engage, which right now are all your beautiful core muscles. So we want to keep pushing, keep breathing, and keep smiling. Get ready for double time. Go. Boom, boom, boom. 
really focus on the form more than the speed. Focus on the form and driving those feet out. Imagine each time you kick, you're kicking someone with your heel, kicking something away that doesn't serve you, a bad habit, a sugar craving, an addiction to caffeine, something that's standing in your way. Kick it out of your way. You can go through this. You're not alone. We're here together. 10 more seconds. Give it everything you got. Kick it all away. Five, go, go. Four, three, two. Lift up and hold. Lift up and hold. Beautiful. Lift up and hold. They call this boat position. Breathe. Stay calm. Stay strong. Hands clasped together. Left side, reach and point. Shoot love out of your heart and out of your fingers into the world. Breathe in. Right side, shoot love. Beautiful. Breathe in. Now shoot love behind you. Woo! Lift those legs up. Hands together for 10, 9, you got it, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and rest. Woo! Give yourself a round of applause for that. Oh, yeah. Stretch to the left. Oh, yeah. Stretch to the right. Oh yeah, pull one knee in, nice and tight. Beautiful. Pull the other knee in, nice and tight. Awesome, awesome. Woo! Now we're gonna bend our knees again. We're gonna bring our hands towards our heels. And we're gonna hip thrust. So that lower back is pressing in the sky. You're squeezing the heck out of your glutes. You wanna squeeze your glutes so hard, it's as if you're giving yourself an import, uh, Charlie horse. Squeeze them and lift that pelvis to the sky. We got 30 seconds here, and then we're gonna alternate feet. So really squeeze and lift that pelvic floor when you do it. Tighten everything, the core, the glutes, your perineum, just squeeze it all up there. Squeeze and try to do it with your face relaxed. Squeeze and try to do it with a calm smile. Squeeze and enjoy it. This is life, baby. This is how you know you're alive. Your buns will be screaming alive. <laughs> Good, now reach that right foot in the air. And keep it going. Try to keep the thighs parallel, the toes reaching to the sky. And keep it going, I know it hurts. That's the reason we're doing it. 10 more. Seven. Three, two. One, switch feet. Nope, don't rest yet. Come on, you got the last side. Here we go. Beautiful. Work hard and you win hard. That's how it works in life. Give it your all and life will give you 10 times more. Beautiful. Squeeze them glutes. Breathe in deep. Stay calm and smile and have fun. This is a butt kicking fun right here. Five more seconds. Three, two, and don't stop. Put the other feet down and just hold. That's right, we're still holding. No rest. Breathe in deep. Now, how can we channel calmness right here? How can we still be totally engaged in the glutes and in the core, but calm in our mind and in our bodies? That is the challenge. Stay calm amidst the chaos. Breathe in and let your body know that it's stronger than your mind. It's stronger than we let it happen. So breathe in and smile. You're here for 15 more seconds. If you want, you can even tap knee to hand. Knee to hand. Get a little extra boost for my level two or three years. Yep, last 10. Nine. Squeeze those glutes though. Don't ever relax them. Eight. Seven. We're almost there. Six. Five. Four, beautiful, three, two, and one, nice. Grab your knees, squeeze them in. Let that lower spine release, maybe coming side to side. Beautiful, beautiful. We're getting pretty close here. I don't want to burn us out. We're running out of time, so we're going to go right into our, our final series here. So we're going to get our knees on our side, and we're just going to crunch up on one side. Nice and easy, boom. Just that one side. So just squeeze up, get a nice pull. Try to never actually relax 
that right ab if you're on your right side, or if you're on your left side, it'll be the right side of your abs. Your obliques muscles are crunching. Try to never actually let it release because it's all about time under tension. The longer we hold those muscles, the quicker they become fatigued, the more they'll make those microscopic tears in your myofascial tissue and the more you'll build quickly. The more you build muscle, the faster you burn fat because muscle demands energy and if you keep the same amount of energy going in, your body has to pull from its energy storages to maintain that muscle, aka your fat. Yippee, 10 more seconds. Eight, six, come on, you got it. Three, two, now don't move from this position, stay up, but lift the leg. Lift the leg like a clamshell door, lift the leg. What muscle is that? <laughs> Focus on it. I'm gonna keep my body in the upright position so I stay engaged in that ab. But if you're tired, put your head down and rest. Wherever you're at is perfect for the day. We got a whole month of these. This is number one. Just be where you're at and love it, wherever you're at. If it's uncomfortable, be comfortable with it. If it's a little, if it's a little painful, well just don't hurt yourself, but enjoy it. We're here to release stress and tension by actually reaching into those crevices and bringing that strength and circulation. So the oxygenation could go in and then we'll have rejuvenation. 10 more seconds, breathe, we're almost there. Beautiful. Five, come on, you got this. Four, three, two, squeeze it, hold it up, hold it up, reach that leg all the way up. And as slow as you can, melt it down. As slow as you can, melt it down. Squeezing every muscle in that right leg all the way to the ground. And beautiful. We're gonna flip over to our last side because you know there's only two of them, so be glad that you're not an octopus. But we'd have to do that seven more times. So breathe in <laughs> and bring that elbow to the booty. Here we go. Yes. There it is, guys. There it is, ladies. Everybody in the world, get pumped. <laughs> we are doing some kick butt fun today, huh? Can I get a yippee? yippee? Can I get a yippee? yippee. All right. Brittany's feeling the fun. That means we're doing a good job. All right, keep it up. We're halfway. Trying to really get a dynamic workout here today. Want to make sure we're feeling fit, moving all those digestive enzymes through our body. Getting all that detox tea in. Getting a little fizzy with me. 10 more seconds. Here we go. 10, 9, 8, come on, 7, that's right, smile, 6, 5, 4, you know what comes next, 3, 2, 1, hold up and lift that leg, yep, that's it, you got it, you got it, squeeze that left oblique, squeeze that side muscle in your core, lift that leg from your glute. Try to imagine it's just your glute squeezing that's lifting your whole leg. Engage from the lower back to the core and then squeeze that glute and lift that leg. It's a lever. Try to twist that glute up to kick that knee in the sky. Keep that core engaged, beautiful. And again, if you need to rest your head or neck, just go for it. This is your workout today, not mine. I'm just giving you some advice and directions to move in. You make it as intense or as not as you want, but obviously we're here to challenge ourselves. So challenge yourselves without judgment. Challenge yourselves knowing you're already perfect exactly where you're at. Challenge yourselves with self-love and fun. Last 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, Hold, stick that leg out and squeeze everything for five, for four, for three, for two. Now as slow as you can, bring that leg down, pressing that heel out, locking the knee out. Raise that slow. And nice. Coming to one of our last exercises today, we're gonna work that lower spine because we've done the front, the side. Now we need the back. Always do dynamic core. So get on your bellies, get nice and adjusted. And put one cheek on the side. And take a deep breath in and give yourself some gratitude. You woke up, it's early in California, rainy, cold, dark, and here you are, wherever you are, working out with us. And then put your right cheek on the side. 
and give yourself some love. Open that left heart channel of love. Tell yourself that you're so proud of yourself and say some nice words that you need to hear. I'm perfect, I'm awesome, I love myself just as I am. I'm worthy, I'm happy, I'm everything that I believe myself to be. All right, that's it. Lift that body up, reach those arms out, lift those legs up and squeeze those glutes. You can even pound on them to make sure they're nice and tight. That's right. <laughs> pound on those tight buns. Make sure you squeeze them with all your might. Oh my God. And breathe. And now go flying like Superwoman or Superman, super person across the globe. Imagine your heart is shining down on the world and it's just healing the planet with your love as you fly and lift higher and soar faster by reaching your arms and your legs to the sky. You move fastwards around the earth, showering the planet with love and healing and light. Smile and beam your love all across the globe. And then go even faster by lifting your hands all the way in front of you. Lift up and squeeze those glutes and kick the feet back. Turbo around the world a hundred times and give it all love everywhere. 10 more seconds. Bring the elbows in nine. Bring them up eight. Beautiful. You're almost there. Seven. Get around the world. Six. It needs your love. Five. Come on. You got it. Four. Here we go. Three. Two. Squeeze and hold everything. One. Five. Four. Three. Two. Great. Press down. Push up. Child's pose, you did it. Woohoo! Way to go. You got up, you got on your mat, and believe it or not, you just healed the whole freaking planet. That's amazing. Your love is so powerful. I can feel it in California up here in cold winter. <laughs> Humble. The rain's coming down, but it feels like warm droplets of your hearts. I appreciate all your love today. What a fantastic start to an amazing new year. Beautiful, beautiful. Now come up to an all fours position. Bring that right foot up and left foot and just stretch it out. Maybe hold for five, four, three, two, and then switch. Bring it up, five, four, three, two, and then we're going to come to the side. So you're going to just rotate that left hand up and reach all the way up. It's like your body is yawning. Yawn your body open with a smile. Beautiful. Bring the hand over head. Stretch that toe all the way to that middle finger, that line. Doesn't make any sound that feels right. Turn to the other side, right foot back. Right arm in the air and yawn your body open. That's right. And then reach that hand in front. Toe to tip of finger. Breathe in. Beautiful. Coming back down. We're going to bring the feet around. The nice cross-legged position. We're going to actually stack the right foot on the left knee and the right knee on the left foot. <laughs> So if this is too much, okay, go, go, go. Pigeon, we're going to do a quick double pigeon, breathe it in, and either melt down or walk your way out, just being really careful of that low back, getting as far into the stretch as you feel is right, and just letting that heart rate melt away now. Uh, that's right, you can let out a sound. Uh, or if you're an omer, you can always, oh, that's right. Walk your legs back up. Take those legs and switch them around. Left leg on top, right leg underneath. Breathe it in and melt down again. If you're an omer, oh. <laughs>
All right, we're almost there. We're gonna come back to our backs. We're gonna grab our feet. And we're just gonna be happy babies in honor of Mahara today. Joining us for our yoga, she gets her own honorable pose and mention, Mahara baby. <laughs> Yay, Mahara. This is certainly a happy pose. Okay. Ah, beautiful, Hi, beautiful, beautiful. Now, depending on your practice, if you need to take a shavasana, which is corpse position, and just rest. If you got more to go, more can go. But that's gonna be Cole's kick butt fun today. <sighs> thank you for your practice and thank you for your love. Thank you. Yeah.